What's up guys? I wanted to pop in here at the beginning of this video to let you guys know that this haul was actually filmed a few days prior to Coachella and Stagecoach and everything mentioning that the festivals are going to be postponed. So I talk a lot about festivals because this was initially a festival clothing haul but most of these clothes are not necessarily specific for festival. They're springtime clothes, summertime clothes, transition clothes, or sweaters in here. It's a mix of a bunch of different things, so I want to pop in here and let you guys know that because I will be saying festival a bunch of times, but that was prior to Coachella and everything being moved around. So just wanna throw that in there. Okay, enjoy. What is up guys and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hello, I'm Keaton and today's video is going to be another amazing Princess Polly haul. You guys know these make my heart so happy and I'm especially really excited about this one because it is festival inspired. So I've got some really fun summer pieces. It's finally warming up here again in Arizona, which was weird because it was like kind of chilly for a while, which I was not about, which is why I moved to Arizona for it to be hot. So it's finally getting up there, it's getting warm, so I've got some cold pieces. At night, it is a little colder. It's around like 45, 50 degrees, which is cold for me. So I do have a little bit of sweaters that I threw in here just because I think that they're good transitions. If some of you guys, wherever you guys live, are going from you know spring cold nights into like warmer days, I think these are great transitions. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. If you guys want to, you guys can subscribe down below. Also, thank you to Princess Polly for sponsoring this video. I also have a discount code for you guys. It is Keaton for 20% off at Princess Polly. So you guys can use that in any of the links down below in the description. I will leave all of the clothes listed. Princess Polly offers free express shipping to the US with orders over $50 and they also offer afterpay. Another thing I wanted to mention is that I'm doing a giveaway with them on my Instagram. So if you guys go to my Instagram right now, two of you guys will be winning $200 gift cards to Princess Polly. Maybe if you guys are going to a festival or you guys just need to revamp your summer wardrobe, you guys can go enter on my Instagram. It's listed down below. So with all of that being said, let's get into the video. I've got so much stuff here. You guys can't even see. I have stuff stacked. I'm just going to start with like, I don't even know, random stuff as we go. All right, these are in no these are in no particular order. I'm just going through them as is. So the first thing I've got is this bathing suit. This is a lavender high-waisted bikini bottom bathing suit. I tried this on and it fits amazing, as you guys can see. And it is just the most gorgeous color to make your skin look really like glowy and bronze. I think it really brings out so many different skin tones. I love this color. I also really like the material and the bottoms suck me in perfectly so that I don't have awkward like rolls over them. I've tried on lots of high-waisted bikini bottoms and they just don't fit right. These ones fit perfectly and also the top is adjustable so if you have larger boobs, smaller boobs, whatever you can adjust the top to that. And I will also tell you guys my sizes as always. So I am a US 2 in these. I am generally in almost everything at Princess Polly. I am a US 4. That is most likely my size. There are specific items I normally get in a 2 just because I feel like it'll fit better. So for example, the bathing suit I felt fit a little bit better. I have a smaller butt and I don't have super small boobs, but normally when I get a size 4 top, my boobs kind of like hang out of them. It gets baggy. So this too fit perfectly and I love it. Next up, I got this pair of white denim jeans. Absolutely love these. These are just flare at the bottom. They are wide, I guess not flare. I guess they're just more wide leg. I really needed a pair of denim jeans. So these are super simple, but I think that wearing darker jeans in like the winter or fall time or whatever, um, you get away with and then I like to bring out the white denim for spring and summer So I really really like these and I also got these again in a size 4 Okay, this jacket obviously is not summer But I think it's super cool and I just had to get it because I think it's great So I got this like I don't even know what this color is. I guess it's like a camel brown um, little trench coat kind of I think it's really cute. I'm actually going to Nashville and so I thought that this would be an adorable little like layering jacket over probably just a crop top and denim um, and so I was just thinking that these type of coats I have another sweater I'm going to show you later but I was thinking that oversized trenches or cardigans are really cute when it is awkwardly like cold in the morning but hot at night because you can always take it off and you can wear it with the crop and it's still not like you're sweating I love this color you guys know I am just all about the nude the nude vibe is my life so 
I chose this and I absolutely love it and I think it's great and I also got this in a size 4. This is I think the only other sweater item I have in here and then all the rest is more festival themed but this is just a white cardigan. Again, very very simple. If I'm going to brunch, I just figured this would be cute. Even if you wore shorts booties, a little crop top, and you threw this little cardigan over, I think it's really, really cute. It's just simple knit white cardigan, and I don't have one like this, and so I figured that I always need just like something to throw over that's not super hot. I always tend to throw on a leather jacket, and then I regret that, so I think that having a little knit is perfect. Next up, this is from Princess Polly's um, festival collection that they just dropped. It's this very cute denim little like bustier top. I absolutely love this, especially for festivals, just because I think that everyone loves the whole like Western theme, but I think you could make this really edgy if you paired it with like black leggings or black shorts or whatever it is, just to kind of like dress it up. I feel like with a lot of jewelry, maybe a really cute skirt would be so good with this. I don't know. I feel like there's tons of ways you can style this because it's denim. So I think it's really fun. Maybe you add a little cowboy hat on with this, go to a festival, pull off your little Western vibe. Um, ooh, I have some cowboy boots I'm going to show you guys too, but this is very cute. Again, a size four. Also, I don't know if it helps to tell you guys my um, bra size, if that helps. Like, I know some things you can't tell if, like, your boobs fit into. So if it helps, my bra size is a 32C, I believe. Yeah, it's a 32C. So if that helps, there you go. Might give you some reference. Um, okay, moving on. Oh, I forgot to talk about this top. So this top as well is from Princess Polly. It's so cute. It's just like this little button up ribbed long sleeve. It's very thin. So although it's a black like long sleeve, it's really thin and feels like light on your skin. So you're not overdoing it. Again, it's more of a transition into like the summer. And I think this would be cute even for a festival because it has like the little loose arms. You could wear a hat with it and you could wear like flare pants. I think that would be pretty fun. Speaking of fun pants, these pants are everything. So I got these. These are just like a moment. These are everything right now. So I don't even know what this is. I think it's like crocodile, but basically they're these high-waisted black crocodile style jeans, jeans, pants, and they have little ties right here, gold detailing. That's what I really love the most is the gold detailing because I wear all gold jewelry all the time and so I thought these would be perfect. These paired with some booties underneath because they're wide legs, so like skinny booties underneath these with little crop top, I think is such a cute look. Like I feel like people could pull this off so, so well and they're just a statement pant and that I really didn't know I needed in my life, but I did. This style skirt is what I've been wanting for a while and I don't know why I haven't ever gotten it before, but it's this little tennis style skirt. It's just white cute and I got this in a size extra small it's so adorable I feel like one of like the things that I love about these is that they make any outfit look girly but you can kind of dress it up so like I was thinking maybe like some high top sneakers with the little like tennis skirt and a crop top would be so cute and you can totally wear this to a festival I think my festival style is not so much like in your face like boho jewelry like my festival style is more like simple like I take pieces that you could wear every day and I kind of make them festival. Like you could literally wear this skirt in a little bikini top like the lavender one I showed you guys and it's cute and festival-y and I think it's adorable. So that is what I love about this and I just, I really think it's so cute. I can't wait to take photos in this. It's Next up, I got this little play suit. So it is again another little nude moment. I got this because I got a really cute hat. From Princess Polly. Actually, I can show you guys now because I'm not going to put it on. But I got this really cute, like, little hat from Princess Polly. And I thought this would be so adorable together. Again, I'm going to Nashville. And there's so many festivals coming up. I think that this would be perfect if you wanted to do, like, a little western girly vibe. Dress it up with a bunch of jewelry. Put a little hat on. I think it would be adorable. And it just has, like, a nice open back also. And I got this, I believe, in a size... All right, this dress is another very simple, easy dress to style. It's just this little floral mini dress. I like it because it has the tie in the front and also the arms have a kind of like stretch to them. I hate dresses where it like suctions on your arm right there. That does not make me want to wear the dress. So I like that it has a little room in there. I just think this was very, very cute and dainty and girly. Again, probably either cowboy boots, thigh high boots, or like those cute little um, right below the knee boots that everyone wears with these I think is very pretty. I also got a scarf 
and I have like a vision like I feel like a good festival look would be like a really flowy cute mini dress like this and then you have your hair tied in a little scarf put some sunglasses on next we've got these black pants I have been waiting for these to come back in stock on Princess Polly for years they're the Flagstaff pant I know the name of them because I search them on the site constantly they're so great they're just these nice little leather pants but they're not like leather like they don't feel I don't know I guess you guys can kind of tell the material from here they have some like faux zippers so the zippers don't actually open up they're just here for looks and I got these in a size 4 as well and they're just perfect because they're cropped right at like the ankle so you can wear pretty booties with these you can wear sneakers with these dress them down I feel like everyone needs a statement staple like black pant and these are a little bit less statement obviously than the crocodile ones the crocodile ones are like a moment these are like you can wear them more casually oh I do have another sweater but this one is cropped so this is just a really pretty nude white um, cropped little sweater. I got this in a size small slash medium. So the model had it and it looked like she was wearing an extra small slash small and like her under boob was kind of showing and I was like, I don't know how I feel about a good under boob moment. So I got it in a small medium and it fits perfectly. Um, it doesn't show under boob, but obviously it's a cropped sweater. So if I lift up a little bit, it would, you know, maybe flash, maybe flash for a moment. So I paired it with like a really pretty white bralette underneath it. Um, Princess Polly has really cute bralettes as well. So I just paired one of those underneath the top and it looks good. I think it's great. Again, another perfect transition if you're going for an early morning brunch moment if you're going to a festival. I know this is weird, but if you've never been to a festival before, it gets really cold at night, especially at Coachella. I always bring a literal sweatshirt hoodie with me every single day of Coachella and I put it on at night over whatever outfit because it's always so cold at night. So while you think it's hot in the desert, it is hot but the winds will really get you. So sweaters like those, like little crop sweaters that can still keep the outfit cute for festivals, I think are perfect. Next up, I've got this very cute, simple white crop top. I know, I pick a lot of white. I like white and nude. I do have some other colored items in here, I swear. But this one's really, really pretty because I love that you can style it however way you want to. Simple little dainty tops like this make it so easy. I feel like you could pair this with one of those flowy like midi skirts or you could pair it with high-waisted shorts. You could pair it with high-waisted little pants that have like, I don't know, I feel like you could even wear this with the crocodile pants I showed you or even like the little tennis skirt. Very easy, it has a little tie. I got this in a size two. So yeah, there's different things I get in different sizes. Seems kind of weird, but obviously you just have to like inference. So some things, if I want it to fit really like snug and cropped on my body, I'll get it in a little size smaller. So this one's a size two. Okay, next thing I got is this set and I think it's super fun. So it is the itters. What was that English, ma'am? It's these pants and I feel like these became super popular having like the skin showing in them so they've got the little lines on the side and then it has the matching black crop top which i love it fits really really nice it's comfortable and it just got like a little one shoulder moment i think that if you are a little bit more simple for festivals which i feel like i am a little bit more simple like i feel like i always just go for like a high-rise jean and like a pretty crop top or a pretty dress I don't really do something crazy for Coachella I think this is perfect I think that the pants are a perfect perfect look to wear with sneakers because they still give you some room they're not too thick they're perfectly like light and so I love these and I think the set is easy because you can also pair it differently so if you don't want to wear the pants with the top you can always just mix and match Ooh, we've got some color sisters look at this beautiful dress so this is like a little I don't know what this is I guess it's like a slip dress I believe is what this would be called it's beautiful it's purplish blue with lavender it's got all different kinds of shades on here which I think is really cute and I got this in a size small I think I probably could have gotten a medium but I'm not mad at the small I think it just like is snug to my body if you want it a little looser maybe go a size up but I think it's really beautiful especially just the colors of it I think are great and I feel like not a lot of people would probably pair these colors together so this would be a really cute simple look but also like bold at the same time especially with my hair color I think this is a moment okay so this is the scarf that I was mentioning like would be really cute wrapped in like in your hair which I think is also pretty cute this one is pretty large though so 
it would be more so for your waist so this is like what you would wrap around your waist if you're wearing a really cute like bikini top which again perfect for festivals it's really light and it's large enough that it can cover like your butt and then obviously you would wear bikini bottoms under it you wouldn't just wear this i mean i wouldn't just wear this I would definitely pair it with either like a white crop top, white bottoms underneath it, maybe some cute booties to walk around in or sneakers, and I think it's a really easy look. And then you can also, again, if you want to, you can probably tie it up as a top in a triangle. My boobs never work for those kinds of tops. I don't know, like they just look like a freaking sack of potatoes. Every time I try and do a little triangle scarf top, my boobs are like, I, I don't even know. It doesn't work. So I probably won't be doing that, but I will wrap it around my waist. Oh my gosh. Okay, this top I'm actually going to talk about with the pants that I tried it on with because I was like, this set together is cute, Keaton. Like, this is what you need to wear ASAP. So this top is this little black lace top. It ties in the middle. It's a low V, deep V. I don't even know. It just ties and it's so beautiful, especially with a little bralette or without a bralette. I feel like I can definitely wear it without a bralette. And then what makes it so cute are the zebra pants, guys. They're high-waisted zebra pants. They are super soft fabric and super light. So they're not going to make you sweat a ton in these. And I think that it's, again, another very simple outfit to pair statement pants with a plain top, which you would be like, oh, whatever. I don't know if that's very Coachella. But, like, it, it like this is something I would 100% wear to Coachella just because I love the pants paired with this and I think with sneakers booties underneath it just a plain black top layer a bunch of jewelry on it I think is a really 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 cute look if you like to keep it really simple or if you want again you could dress it up I think that you could do the black crop top with really pretty like statement pants or do the statement pants with a different crop top whatever it is you guys are feeling but this outfit together when I tried it on I really really liked it and I was very excited to show you guys okay next up this might seem a little weird but this is another thing that I put together online and so um, this I thought was really cute for, I don't know, probably like a brunch or something like that. Some, or I guess you could do like a little like a business meeting in these. I don't know. But there are these blue, baby blue trousers and they're really pretty and light. And I don't know, I just really loved the color of these. And so then I found the plaid crop top. I got this in a size four as well. And I was like, these are such pretty colors together. I feel like they work so well and they could work great separately. I think that I could do the crop top either with just plain denim just to dress it down and make it a little more casual. But I picked this top out specifically because I'm going to Nashville and I thought it would be cute. But I think that it works perfectly for festivals because you could also just dress it up and make it one of those cowgirl e looks. Again, this with the hat from Princess Polly. And then there's some boots I'm gonna show you. Actually, I could show you the boots now. Let me show you the boots. These are the boots. Look at these. These babies are beautiful. How cool would this be at a music festival? If you guys are going to Stagecoach or Coachella or whatever it is, you wear a cute little crop top and you wear some little denim shorts with this throw these cowboy boots on and I think they're perfect. I don't know if these are technically really cowboy boots, but they're just fun and cute and trendy and I loved them. So I had to show you guys them. I also feel like what I like about all of these pieces is that they're not just for festivals. You can style them so many different ways, which is what I love to do. So, all right, these next three pieces, they're the last, I think they're the last, they're the last clothing pieces and they are my favorite pieces from the whole haul. I'm not kidding. So the first one, is this beautiful black boussier again it's more of like that crocodile ish style print it's awesome i think it looks so edgy and so fun this paired with either like a cute skirt i would definitely probably just wear this with like denim jeans high-rise denim jeans even low-rise denim jeans a lot of gold jewelry maybe if you want to throw like a little leather jacket over it or just any kind of sweater over this i think it's cute i also love to style bustiers with turtlenecks as you guys know i've done that before on my instagram you just wear like a cute little turtleneck and then you throw the bustier over it i think this is a really cool statement one to work so this is awesome i got it in a size four okay this top is my favorite top i think from the entire haul i love it i think it's cute i think it's probably if i could be a top I would be this top. I think it's perfect. It's nudish, pinkish, 
bustier oh my gosh my air conditioning just kicked in and it's so loud i'm sorry um but it's cute it's just like i don't know it's the perfect top because it has so much structure but at the same time it fits really comfortably i got a size four again in this top and i got a four in the black bustier but this one's just perfect again i would just wear it with high-rise denim i believe there are matching pants to this which would be a very awesome look if you guys are into that all right next up i got this beautiful green dress this dress is what i got because i was like this is like my aerial moment i have my red hair and then paired with this beautiful green dress is just amazing i love a good rouge so i love that it's rouged on the side and then i've also got this in an extra small it's really great it's some pretty thick material so you will probably sweat a little bit in this but the material is not like caught in me to where it would stick to your body i don't know how to describe it but it feels really really nice and i just love the way it looks and i think it's a beautiful color like i feel like this on anyone's skin tone is great so now i'm going to show you guys my accessories so the first thing is this backpack this is the perfect size for Coachella. You can't really bring any big bags into Coachella or any really music festivals because they're super strict about obviously bringing bags in. They don't want you to bring anything that you're not supposed to have. So this is a perfect size. It's great. It's white, so it will match almost every single thing that you wear. And I just think it's great because it would fit camera, sunscreen, like anything that you wanted in here. This little guy right here, how cute is she? I love her. The cutest. The prettiest little pink bag just snaps open. Obviously, you can't fit a crap ton in here. Um, that's just because it is mainly for looks. But there are crossbody straps. You can attach them right here and wear it like low. You don't have to carry it just by the handle. I thought it was just really, really cute. These are obviously for just like specific outfits that you really just want to like wear with a small bag, just easy going out. I feel like if you're going out to an event or somewhere you can't really take anything big you want to just bring a really small bag and I thought the color was just really beautiful and cute and spring and summer vibe so I love it this bag guys is it's everything it is literally if I could be a bag this is the bag I would be look at this bag it looks so funny like just holding it up but when you put it on your shoulder guys this is a look i literally don't care what you say this is so cute obviously it's a very skinny it does not fit much in here it does fit more than you would think though like it stretches pretty wide so it doesn't just like fit a card or a phone it does fit a few things in here i could definitely fit my like film camera in here and my keys and my phone and like be good to go and it would work but how adorable is this? I just think it's everything. It's the perfect nude and it just would go with every outfit basically. Next, I've got two pair of sunglasses that I'm super excited about. I think these are perfect. You guys know I love a good sunglass from Princess Polly. These ones are so sick because they're kind of tinted blue. So if you guys can see, look how I look like. I don't even know what to say. I always feel like a new woman with sunglasses on. Like I just feel bougie. I feel like people shouldn't be talking to me. Okay, I don't actually feel like that, but these are so cute. They're blue tinted and they're kind of like ombre-esque. Love those. These ones are more simple. They're kind of like everyday. I feel like those, I don't know if they're everyday and they're much darker. So these are a more tortoise brown look. Very simple, cute, easy, everyday tortoise. Tortoise, what? Tortoise, tortoise tortoise look i don't know they're pretty cool though i think they're kind of fun and they're a much darker like tint than these ones these ones are obviously a little bit more like look vibe um and these ones are everyday like i would keep these in my car drive around have them these i would be like walking in public i would be walking inside with these on bougie um another thing is i got a set of rings i only have two of them on right now but they're from princess polly they've just got this i don't know if it'll focus but they're just like cute black rings like they've got gold on them and then they've just got black detailing i think that these are really easy everyday rings so i paired them with this outfit and i feel like it goes good i feel like you could dress up any of the looks and wear these and it's very easy um next up i'm gonna open up these pair of shoes i think this is the last item i have and this item is just it's beautiful and i don't really care what anyone has to say because i think i'm gonna get comments being like 
what are those? And I don't care because they're fun, okay? Look at these. Just, I don't even know what these are called. Thick booty platform. I don't know, but they're the knee high length, which I love. I think that's super in right now. These are perfect festival shoes. Obviously, I would recommend breaking them in first, but these are like what you could wear. Not only because they're like really cute and like thick, easy, but like they have such a platform, it'll be really easy to walk around in. And they also just have like, I don't know, I just feel like they make every look if you're wearing um, to any festival super easy. If you're wearing shorts, if you're wearing a skirt, even if you're wearing like really like the long pants, like you could literally wear the zebra pants and put these under it and it's so cute. So I really, really, really like these and I think they're probably the most perfect like festival looking shoes that I would wear. I definitely would probably be wearing those because I just feel like my outfits are always more simple and a good statement black platform boot is perfect. So I think that's it for my haul. I'm looking to make sure I didn't forget anything. There's so much stuff. Oh, lastly is this. Okay, this is what all of you guys need. Look how beautiful. It's this gorgeous, gorgeous? Did I put a T or a D at the end of that? I don't know. But it's this gorgeous gold bell and this is perfect. Any of these outfits, you literally could throw this on. In my head, I was kind of imagining the wrapped skirt around your waist or the wrapped scarf around your waist and then you put the gold chain over it and it's just like, oh my gosh, it just adds so much more to your outfit and it really dresses it up, especially if you're not going for something super crazy or you are going for like a full on gypsy like gold vibe. This is great and also has just like the perfect little sequins on it. You just, oh, it's cold. Oh my God, I just put that on my waist and it was freezing. Okay, well, this is what it looks like and I think it's great for Coachella or Stagecoach or everyday life, whatever you want to wear it for, people. It doesn't really matter. So that is it for my Princess Polly haul. I love all of these pieces so much. You guys will be seeing these on my Instagram for probably weeks to come. I will probably be wearing these just in my everyday life. And some of them I'm definitely going to be saving for festival looks. So thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. Again, if you guys want to, you guys can shop all of them in the links in the description down below. And you guys can use my code Keaton for 20% off. And don't forget to check out my Instagram because I am doing a giveaway with Princess Polly. Two $200 gift cards to shop at Princess Polly. So if you guys want any of this, you guys can enter on my Instagram and you guys could possibly win. So thank you guys so much again for watching. Thank you to Princess Polly for sponsoring and I will see you guys next time.